Welcome to Everything Money. Today we will look at Riot Blockchain, an interesting crypto mining company, Paul. We will look at the fundamentals and financials behind this company and separate it from the ticker price. You will learn how to evaluate a company like Riot moving forward and using our software. The goal is to fire your financial planner and get a hold of your investments. And we will show you how to trade Riot at a quicker pace with Mo in the Binance Nation. But who are we? I bring your normal person questions to Paul and Mo, a couple guys who manage over $100 million in real estate, businesses, and stocks. And we will show you our thought process behind investing in a company like Riot Blockchain. Paul, I don't think you'll be investing in this one, but show us your thought process. Go ahead. Okay, so this is our exclusive proprietary software. Um, I'm going to go to the eight pillars tab. I'm going to type in Riot and look for Riot Blockchain. Now, this company mines Bitcoin, which... We have said in the past, we're not huge fans of Bitcoin, Paul. You Obviously, we don't understand it. We choose not to understand it, but this company w fell big time in, in, in recently, and, and Tim and I wanted to show you, this is Riot Blockchain. In is this two, a joke? This in thing 2007, was... this was $3,100 oh, wow. stock. Wait a second, I'm confused here. It is now... <laughs> it is $30, $30. but even worse... <laughs> Look at the one-year chart. It was three thousand six hundred and thirty-eight dollars a share, thirty-six a coin or whatever. And how much bigger is. is blockchain technology now than it was in two thousand? So if you were back there in two thousand seven, and you said blockchain's the future because you saw all this crypto taking off, and you bought and Ryan. you bought this, you'd have ninety-nine percent less money today. But even more telling, what was uh, Mo? What was Bitcoin in, in February? What was Bitcoin uh, on February? $64,000? Go look it up. February 17th, what was Bitcoin? We talk about, folks, here's the gist. We talk about companies like Cisco, like Intel, that in their grandest of booms 20 years ago, reached an elite stock price, and it has since crashed and never gotten back to that. So to, really, to recap that, the stock is lower today than it was 20 years ago, even though their revenue and profit are three and four times higher. So it's not just about growth. It's about paying a fair price for growth. So what was um, what was Bitcoin in February of this year? February, February 17th. February 17th was 51,000 51, It is $65,000 today. That oh, is 30% oh, higher. And look at the stock price. Uh oh, Paul. 78 down to 30. So please. Oh my gosh, these numbers are Do me are just, a favor. Oh gosh. If you really really believe that valuations don't matter, just Go look at history. This is short-term history. Bitcoin is higher in price by 30%, and the stock is down by over 50%, 60%. How can you possibly say with a straight face that valuations don't matter? How Paul, can you possibly Paul, say that? Paul, we watch Andre Jeek, who has millions of subscribers, say buying Bitcoin alone, let alone the subsidiary companies that help it, there's regardless of entry price. Don't even, it doesn't even matter what you buy it at, you're gonna be a millionaire. And guess what, I've heard this before several times, and you know who they was from? Uh -oh. People who end up losing a lot of money. Listen, and it happens to everybody. I, I won't talk about yesterday, I was, I was out on a golf course with somebody who manages $2 billion, and he was giving me reasons why this market is so different. I kept saying to him, so you're saying it's different. He smiled and said, I'm not saying that, I'm saying it's evolved. I'm like, so you're saying it's different. And everything he said has been the thing that's been said about every major bull market in any asset in the history of time. So what are we missing? Can you even look at the income statement for this puppy? Guys, so I wanna look up, like, what are we missing here? Why was the stock down 99% and still stuck around? I even Googled Riot Blockchain. If you see right here on Wikipedia, sure enough, it was founded in 2000. Now I'm actually gonna go to the Wikipedia page because maybe they'll say something to me. Oh wait, it's not, it's not Wikipedia, it's, um, it's Google's feedback. So let's see if there's a Wikipedia page for it. Because a lot of times, Riot Blockchain. Oh, it's not even, okay. This is their website about management team. They don't even have a description of the company. So an article written on Yahoo Finance yesterday said this is one of the top 11 crypto stocks to buy according to hedge funds. This is number 10 was Riot Blockchain. So, I mean, I guess they're buying the dip here, the 99% dip. Public company changes name to Riot. So what was it originally? The company was formerly known as Bio, Bioptics and changed its name to Riot Blockchain in October of Veterinary 2017. products, patents, okay. But they were incorporated in 2000. Okay, SEC chairman, ready for this one, guys? Uh-oh. 
Nobody should think it's okay to change your name to something that involves blockchain when you have no real underlying oh blockchain business plan God. and try to sell securities based on the hype around blockchain. <laughs> SEC Chairman Jay Clayton said. Well, he doesn't know anything, does he? What was that? He doesn't know anything. Does well, I mean, he, he, I mean, the SEC missed Madoff. So hey, what's what's the I'm, date? What's the date that that article was? 2018. Written? It was um, the beginning. Uh, February 16th of 2018, the that day makes, before the birthday. That makes sense because if you go back here and you look. This was the end of 2017, and it came up, and then he probably said that, and it fell straight down. Yeah, that's that's the smaller blip. Yes, this is the smaller one. This this one only went to forty four dollars. Oh God! Come on, Tim. Well, <laughs> here's the point of all of this, folks. If you're a normal person working a normal job, you come home with kids, you hear a little bit of news, and all of a sudden, some of your friends say Riot's the place to go. I look on YouTube, Paul. Riot blockchains. It's a fifty x potential. It's a one hundred x potential. Everyone is in love with the stock except us. We'd love to be the adult in the room to maybe warn you that when you, just because your friends are talking about it, it doesn't mean it's real and awesome. Go ahead, Paul. Look at their revenue, guys. 2012, $128,000 in revenue. That's what I mean. Seth Paul. does way more just in doing photography for weddings every year. Yes. 67000 200000 All these things up here, they just started getting the millions recently. And it took a major bump, major, major explosion in, in crypto for that to happen. Look at their profit. They actually made profit this past year. They had losses every other year, but they actually made profit that year. Okay, guys, unfortunately for us, we're just going to skip to the eight pillars tab. Our software will just give you the recap for the eight pillars. The only check marks here are revenue growth and income growth. Yes. The rest of it, we don't even have profit for five years or free cash flow for five years to even evaluate the, the, the company. They lose money and they lose cash flow every single year. Does that mean it can't be a good investment? You know what I want to see? Look at this. Shares outstanding. Look at that percentage. Have oh, we ever seen a percentage that big? Oh my God. 2,000, not 2,000 shares, Paul. 2,000 percent. Percent. Guys, this is a prime example. Let's pull up a company like, and you're going to say, don't compare it to Intel. Let's just pick up a company like Intel. Because I'm going to show you how it compares for something I can understand. Folks, three years ago, a friend of mine not only advised me to get into Bitcoin, but advised me to get in one of these Bitcoin mining companies. I sent $3,000, Paul, to some company I never heard of. And of course, I never got that money back, Paul, at all. I mean, some, it's, it's, this isn't far-fetched to believe in some of these blockchain amazing technology companies. Paul, not only can you care, compare it to Intel, something that we like right now, but compare it to something like Amazon, which is still overpriced yeah, in our right. opinion, but it's reasonable. <laughs> Amazon. Yes. Eight it's, pillars of Amazon. Oh, same checks. Yeah. Same checks. Okay, this is great. Perfect. Perfect example, Mo. Same checks. But look at their five year PE. Five year free cash flow um, multiple, 119. Five year PE, 137. They've only increased their shares by 6.5%. Their debt's only 8.8 .8 times their five year free cash. They have five year free cash flow. Mm -hmm. 14 and a half billion in free cash flow in the last five years. This is what I'm saying when we talk about companies. We want to analyze companies that we can sit there. First off, the future is impossible to predict. So at least find companies where they actually have a history that you can actually look at and say, hey, this management team, they've done this. This guy just joined the management team a couple years ago or last year, whatever it was. It's like, I'm not saying the company is going to zero, but what I'm saying is you as an investor, your job is to let the world send pitches your way and you only swing when it feels right. That's it. Warren Buffett talks about this all the time. You're an investor. You get unlimited pitches. You'll never, ever, ever strike out as long as you don't swing. Pitch after pitch. Wait till it's in your sweet spot. Boom. Hit it out of the park. Riot blockchain is not that. Look at Amazon. They have the exact same check marks. And this one, I'd much rather have Amazon than Riot blockchain. 100%. It's just crazy. What we're trying to teach here is a process. The process is for those who don't have FOMO. If you have a fear of missing out, and you want to change that, listen to our videos, join our software, do all of this stuff. You can get everything here to help you make better decisions on investing. That's it. And the great part is the software is all on a mobile app too. And we have 6,000 people that you can actually sit there and talk to about all these ideas, including blockchain. We have a crypto and blockchain chat within our chats. Do I, do I support it? No, I don't, but I'm not here to tell people what not to talk about, right? Yeah. So if you like it, Click everythingmoney.com or click on our Patreon. You can join the software. It's only 90 cents a day. You get everything here. You get this main page with all the software coming, exclusive content every single day from us. That's actually already here. It's a no-brainer. It's 90 cents a day. 
if you're serious about making money, even one or 2% increase in your returns will yield you hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars in retirement. It's well worth 90 cents per day. Without holding Riot for a long time, you can trade it. You can take advantage of these ridiculous swings with Mo in the Bitness <clears throat> Nation, and he will guide you through some trades. Mo, what's going on with this crazy company? So I've said this on so many videos before. I'm going to say it again. This, this is th just your typical definition of hype stocks. I mean, anytime you see this pattern, that's what it is. I mean, it's, I'm not saying that these things can't work out in the long run for you. I don't necessarily know if this one will. But th anytime you see a pattern like that, please be a little bit leery. With that being said, my way of teaching works on crypto. If you want to trade crypto, go for it. I don't do that. But the, 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 the system is still in place for it. You have volume coming in. Now, right now, you're starting to get that rollover down into the sweet spot to the downside. But let's look back. Let's play Monday morning quarterback. Yep. If you would have followed this, you had a perfect move up through the sweet spot, good volume coming in, could have added on an engulfing candlestick, ran it right up to the 100-day moving average, and now it's falling right back down. It's as easy as that. Of course, you're going to say I'm playing Monday morning quarterback. Go look at tons and tons and tons of stocks. They do the exact same thing, and you'll learn to catch them in the process of them doing that. So if this speaks to you, $1.30 more per day, you still get all of the software that everything money comes with, and you get access to me, all of my teaching videos, all the people in the community. It's wonderful. The Nas Nation. Final take on companies like this, Paul, if go, not just Riot. I go, mean, go watch our other videos. You'll see I'm very consistent about it. I like to see something that I can make a reasonable assessment of what they're going to make in the future. Watch our videos, learn from us, use the software to help grow your wealth. We will see you in the next video. Fondle that thumbs up on the way out. Thanks for watching.